Hello everybody, today I will show you how to make your own map quiz with GIMP. I will show you three types of quizzes to make, one where you can place a flag in the wrong country, one where you can change the borders and one where you can combine both. So first open up GIMP, then go to Google and search for Europe borders map or any region you want and copy an image you like and paste it on GIMP by pressing Ctrl V. First we are going to change the borders, which is real simple, just select the pencil tool. Then click on this box, pick the eyedropper and click on the inside of any country for the color selection of the pencil that we are going to use to erase the borders. The map you chose might not be white like mine, that's why I didn't just select white at once. You can change the pencil size here, the smaller the pencil size you choose, the more detailed job you can do. Then we are going to zoom in and start drawing over a border we want to change. Let's give Kaliningrad to Poland. And that's it for erasing borders. Now, to draw new borders, we just have to change the pencil's color to match that of the borders and start mapping. Let's revive Kaliningrad and make it bigger. Make sure that the change is not obvious. Now, let's add some flags. First, go to the bottom right corner and add a new transparent layer, then go to Google, search for the flag you want, copy it and paste it on GIMP by pressing Ctrl V. Then pick the scale tool, adjust, and place your picture over the country you want. Click scale, and then let's rotate the polish flag with the rotate tool to see how many people will notice it. Then right click on the floating selection and click anchor layer. And move the flag layer under the map layer and select the map layer by clicking on it. Then select the fuzzy select tool and click on the country that the flag is under. And press Ctrl X and then Ctrl Shift A. If further adjustment are needed, just select the flag layer and either the move or the scale tool and rearrange the flag. When you are satisfied, just merge the two layers together. Let's do another one. This time we will put the Belgium flag over in Germany. If the country you want to add a flag is to narrow or long and the flag does appear right, just unlink the dimensions on the flag and make the flag slimmer. And that was it. To combine the two methods together, you're first going to have to change the borders and then just add the flags, like you would, to complete the map. Just add some correct flags and you are finished. I hope this video was helpful. Thanks a lot for watching.